So Red Dead Online is getting a brand new update that's going to feature lots of new content and stuff and there's going to be passes in the game as well that allow you to unlock some cool items. I recommend 100% that you get your hands on these passes, however I do not recommend that you purchase them with real money. They are each going to cost 25 gold bars, there are going to be 4 of them, not released at the same time. So all you need to do to like initially start off and participate in the passes is get your hands on 25 gold bars. I have recently done a video on the easiest way to obtain gold bars and there are hundreds of videos across YouTube. There are probably text posts on forums and stuff with tips on how to get them the fastest and the easiest ways. And the reason I am recommending getting this pass is because the Quick Draw Club is a series of four distinct rapid fire passes that are going to arrive in consecutive installments over the coming months. What's going to happen is you are going to basically put down a deposit of 25 gold bars and you don't need to worry about gold for anything else at the moment because for the crimes and the opportunities and stuff, the other content coming into the game, it states there's no upfront cost for it, so you don't have to pay gold to take part in that stuff. So all you need to do is get your hands on 25 gold bars, purchase this pass, play through and play enough of the game to level the pass all the way up. There are going to be 25 ranks in each of these passes. So what you do is you purchase pass number one, you go through the 25 ranks, and when you have done that and reached rank 25, you would have earned your 25 gold bars back. So all the cool stuff you're going to get through those levels, outfits, different benefits and stuff for your player, whatever they decide to put into the passes, all of that stuff for pass 1 will be completely free. And then with pass 2, you're going to do exactly the same thing. You're going to spend 25 gold bars, get access to it, complete the 25 ranks, get all the goodies, get your gold bars back and then all you need to do is exactly the same thing for pass three and pass four you're going to get rewards bonuses and items to help live life on the fringe of the law you're going to start these passes off with dutch's outfit if you're a fan of dutch from the story there's going to be his outfit that you can put on your online character there are going to be lots of other cool stuff in there as well and all you have to do is put the initial 25 gold bar cost into the pass Get it back from number one, put it into two, get it back from number two, do the same for three and four. And then what that's going to do, as well as giving you 100 ranks of cool stuff to use in the game in Red Dead Online, it's also going to give you free access to the second Halloween pass, completely free. So essentially, you put down 25 gold bars, go through five passes of stuff that you can use in the game, and you're getting your gold back. That's why I don't recommend using real money. I recommend just playing the game, earning the gold bars, because then you haven't put any money into it. You're getting all this free stuff. You're getting your gold back. It's a win-win situation. There is no reason for a player of Red Dead Online that feels they're going to put in enough time to reach the 25 ranks in all of the passes. There's no reason for a Red Dead player to not invest in these passes. You're getting stuff for, like, completely free. Altogether... With the Quick Draw Club, the four passes, there will be 100 ranks. I don't think it's going to take too long to level them up. I'm not entirely sure about anything related to the Halloween pass, just besides it will be free. Not even if you complete the passes, just if you purchase all four. However, because you're getting your 25 gold bars back for completing all the ranks, I recommend completing all the passes, because you're going to just get more free items the more levels you complete. So 100% if you're checking out the Blood Money update on July 13th, check out the pass that comes with it. If you've got yourself 25 gold bars by then, even if it takes a little bit longer to get your hands on the 25 gold bars, I 100% recommend getting your hands on these things, leveling them up, getting all the goodies, getting your gold bars back. There is nothing to lose as long as you play the game. And on that note, we're going to leave the video there. Let me know your thoughts and stuff in the comments and I'll see you in the next one. I hope you guys enjoyed it.